Our next question comes from uh, Billy out of Pennsylvania. And Billy has a question on class one, two, or three circuits. And uh, Billy's question is, uh, does 70E uh, consider a class one, two, or three circuit uh, to be hazardous uh, from shock or electrical arc type conditions? And uh, uh, Billy, the, the class two circuit is not considered uh, to be under uh, that type of a situation or condition when you're working on it. And I would refer you to the definition of electrical hazard uh, in the informational note on page 11 of 70E. And there the information is given that a class two circuit is not considered a hazardous type circuit. But uh, in the NEC, if you looked at 725.41A and B, then you'll find power and uh, limited and uh, unlimited power circuits. And of course, you'll find 120, 240, uh, 208, 480 volt uh, uh, unpower limited circuits that could be hazardous. And then of course, your class one could operate at 1,000 volt amps or less. Uh, you know, at 30 uh, volts or less, and uh, it could be considered hazardous. So, uh, you know, I believe it's uh, RAM 130.2 or 110.2 and 70E that you're to check uh, a low voltage type system of, uh, say, of less than 50 volts to ensure it's not a shock hazard or a fire hazard. So uh, you do have a responsibility to check that out. But if you look at uh, the informational node and look at the definition of electrical hazard on page 11 of the NE, uh, excuse me, 70E, then you will find that a class 2 is not considered a hazardous type circuit in accordance with that uh, definition and informational node on page 11 of 70E. I hope this information will be helpful to you.